Whoa, 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 wait. Who is that? Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 obvious stunt doubles in movies. Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we're looking at stunt doubles that looked so little like the stars they were subbing in for that they were impossible to miss. Number 10, Mild Jumping, Tremors. Who knew that one of the side effects of earthquakes was shape-shifting? While the survivors are on the run from the giant worms causing tremors all over town, they have to move from rooftop to rooftop just to stay safe from the subterranean monsters. But between attempts to save their friends and trying to stop the monsters, they need to come down eventually. Good luck, shithead. As Valentine jumps down, the roof beneath him breaks, and in his fall, Kevin Bacon's distinct features magically disappear, as we're treated to a shot of his stuntman's noticeably softer features. Number 9. Breaking Windows, Blade Runner <laughs> Even classic movies aren't safe from a few errors. During the dramatic chase between Deckard and Zora, neon is glowing and the music is blaring to create one of the most stylish scenes in the film. Just as it looks like Zora might get away, Deckard pulls out his gun and shoots her, launching her through panes of glass for one of the most memorable scenes in cinema history. <laughs> But what viewers may also remember is the very clear stunt double rocking what appears to be a Bob Ross wig as she hurdles her way through the shards of glass. Number 8. Forest Run, Twilight. I know what you are. See it. You've heard of stunt doubles, but run doubles are definitely a new one. Given all the curious moments in this vampire love story, it was refreshing to see one of the book's most intense moments brought to life so exhilaratingly, except for one distracting detail. As Edward finally reveals his dark secret to Bella, he throws her on his back and makes a mad dash through the woods, at breakneck speeds no less. The speed must have pushed their skin back, however, as one of the scene's cuts shows a piggybacking couple that barely resembles Kristen Stewart and Robert Pattinson. Number 7. Growing Pains, Elf All right, let's do this. Will Ferrell isn't the only one growing taller than expected in this holiday romp. As Buddy meets his father, he starts to take an office life, leading to some interesting business tactics. I didn't know you had elves working here. When his father finally scores a meeting with children's writer Miles Finch, things quickly get heated as Buddy mistakes him for one of Santa's elves, angering the writer to no end. You feeling strong, my friend? Call me Elf one more time. Quickly turning into an office brawl, Finch doesn't let the clear size difference stop him from kicking Buddy's butt, although one kick balanced the scales, as the angle reveals someone several feet taller than Peter Dinklage. Number 6. Parachuting Double, Point Break I know it's hard for you, Johnny! Parachuting is about as dangerous as stunts get, so it always pays not to focus on faces. While undercover in a gang of thieves, Johnny's forced to put himself in some pretty hazardous situations, but none is more life-threatening than the gang's skydiving session. Adios, amigo! Bodhi jumps out of the plane, leaving Johnny without a shoot, so Johnny jumps out after him, dive bombing in pursuit. When he finally collides with Bodhi mid-fall, viewers are treated to an extended face shot of Keanu Reeves' stuntman, making all the clever shooting that preceded it become pretty useless. Bullshit, Bodhi! You are crazy! Number 5. Was that a man? The Princess Bride. You mock my pain! Life is pain, Highness. A good stuntman might get more use than you'd ever anticipate. As Wesley and Buttercup get a rare moment to talk, their egos get the better of them and they start fighting. I died that day! You can die too for all I care! Oh. Letting their argument get out of hand, Buttercup pushes Wesley downhill and realizing the very real gravity of her actions, goes tumbling after him. In one of the more surprising uses of a double, however, it becomes very clear that Buttercup's rolling double is a man, who on closer inspection also appears to be standing in for Wesley as he bounces his way down. Number 4. Boat Explosion – Face Off You'd think a movie about face swapping would have given a lot more attention to their subject matter. In the climactic finale of this identity switch thriller, Caster Troy and Sean Archer's showdown on speedboats has enough bullets and explosions to make Michael Bay blush. Fighting on the same boat, the two quickly stop focusing on driving and find their boat crashing and exploding. While there are many moments in the chase where keen eyes can spot their fill-ins, the crash gives a nice slow-mo focus on the pair, showing two faces clearly different from the iconic actors. Number 3. Smaller Jaws, Moonraker 
When you name a character after their teeth, people will notice when they're wrong. When Bond fights a couple of goons on the plane, he gets the upper hand before getting pushed out of the plane by the metal teeth jaws for some skydiving action. While Bond fights one goon, face shots reveal Roger Moore's obvious stand-in before Bond finally defeats the henchman to secure a parachute. As Jaws moves into attack, the long face shots show some pearly whites instead of metal munchers, making it unclear why they didn't at least give the double some metal teeth for his leap of faith. Number 2. Gender Swapped – Lara Croft Tomb Raider – The Cradle of Life A good rule for a believable stunt double should be to make sure that your actors are the same gender. While Laura Croft may be one of the most badass archaeologists to ever grace the movie screen, some of her craziest antics required some special talent to pull off. When Croft approaches her boning friends, her burly figure is all too noticeable, and she shows more serious muscle while doing a few flips on her jet ski. Later in the movie, she base jumps, and it's clear that even a good wig and wingsuit aren't enough to hide the male figure diving at Angelina Jolie's place. Number 1. Motorcycle Chase – Terminator 2 – Judgment Day The T-1000 isn't the only one who can change his looks. In this action-filled truck chase from this installment of the Killer Robot franchise, John Connor is near death's door as the shape-shifting Terminator tries to run him over. With Arnie's Terminator coming to the rescue, things start to pick up just as quickly as they get weird. Rounding the truck to save John, Arnie's face looks markedly different, while John seems to be hiding his clear height difference. While one offense was bad enough, the epic explosion that ends the chase gives us one more glimpse of the duo in all their mismatched glory. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo and subscribe for new videos every day.